All right, and here we go with our tail of the tape for our second fight of the night, Joseph Cleveland and Vince Morales. This one could be like the last one when it comes down to professional experience. Will Vince Morales overcome his nerves in his pro debut? We are about to find out as we go inside the cage with Britt Talbert. And now, fight fans, let's meet our fighters. First, fighting out of the red corner with a record of two wins against one defeat. He weighs in at 142 and one half pounds. He stands five feet seven inches tall and he represents Sick Jitsu from Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. Let's welcome Joseph the Boogeyman, Cleveland. And fighting out of the blue corner after two successful fights with us in the amateur ranks here on Front Street Fights, he makes his pro debut tonight, weighing in at 144 pounds. Standing five feet, six inches tall, he represents Fearless MMA from Ontario, Oregon. Let's welcome back Vince Vendetta Morales. Our referee when the action begins will be Mr. Roland Day. And now, fight fans, here we go with another downtown throwdown. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for this one. Vince Vendetta Morales. Little did you know, Vendetta is actually not a nickname. That really is his middle name. I did find that out. That, oh, wow. <laughs> that, that's it's legitimately his middle name. Here we go. Vince Vendetta Morales, Joseph Cleveland. We are underway. Round number one. Couple nice. of quick strikes there by Joseph Cleveland. Going for the takedown, but Vince Morales able to fight it off. Yeah, once they slow down, I can start to comment on what's happening. But Vince, right now, there's a, yeah. there's a lot going back and forth. And a nice good takedown take down there by Joseph Cleveland. Joseph did a great job. He even got wizard uh, by a wizard, which uh, by uh, by Vince, you know. And now he's dragging him back to the center so he can try to put his head back in the cage instead of letting him wall walk. So that's actually what you're seeing right now. And as much as Joseph Cleveland is the aggressive early on, Vince Morales doing a really good job countering everything coming his way. The takedown, the punches. Uh, it, right now, seems to have a dominant a front position. Choke. This is actually. This is what's called an anaconda, where you lock on the outside. He needs a roll. And he rolled out of it, but did Vince no, Vendetta no, no. Morales lock it tighter. in? It, if Vince locks his leg in a half guard, he'll actually finish the choke. So in essence, if he crunches him up, you know, in layman's term. Uh, <laughs> Look at the leg strength that Joseph Cleveland but, displaying but right Joseph now. Joseph Cleveland needs to straighten his body out and align his spine with the other to, uh, to alleviate the pressure. That's number one, to get out of that. Vince doing a good job keeping the weight on there. Vince needs to almost step over to mount to tighten it up or catch a half guard to tighten up with what's called an anaconda And choke. he does just that. Steps over to full mount, trying now to get that front choke. Switch he's, right got, to he's got a good lock in. We could see a tap coming quick. Wow. But Joseph Cleveland Watch able to get out Watch of that one. Neck. But how much did Watch that do? There it was. He did the right he's got thing. that choke locked in. This looks like it's it. But he's not given up just yet. Can Joseph Cleveland withstand this? The pressure that Vince is putting on right now. We are just, he taps out. Wow. It's over. Vince Morales successful in his pro debut as we see two fights in a row via a rear naked choke. There wasn't one thing that, uh, that Vince did wrong there. He defended against the cage very well. His submissions went really well. And, and as to what I was talking about earlier in the last fight with Matt Jones, is it sticky? You know, that, that favors the grappler in those first two minutes until they get until they break their sweat. And we saw there, in, in the beginning there, Joseph Cleveland, definitely the aggressor. He came in, he shot early. But Vince, while it knocked him back just a little bit, able to withstand that early onslaught there. And, and really, as you can see, here's, here's a right hand of, to a double leg right he, here. The Overhand right to a double leg. There you go. But and still, Vince gets the wizard right there and defends it. Does really well, but basically what was happening was Cleveland was trying to get his hips underneath him. There's a wizard again by Vince. And, and he did everything right. Now he went from the anaconda. Uh, Vince went from the anaconda to the guillotine and then right into the rear naked choke. And then and right it, here. It looked for a minute, it looked right here that, that Joseph was going to be able to maybe get out of it. But at the end of the day, when he had the other hold just before that, that obviously took too much out of him. He, he lost the air pressure 
lost the ability to breathe and, and just unable to to overcome the rear naked Vince, choke there by Vince Morales. Vince Morales is an amazing, amazing prospect for the future of this town. All right, we're going to head back into the ring right now for the official decision with Britt Talbert. And once again, Front Street Fight fans, another action-packed tilt here tonight. How about a round of applause for both of our fighters here in this second professional fight of the night? Let's make some noise. Our winner here tonight gets a tap out at 151 of the first round via rear naked choke in his professional debut here at Front Street Fights. How about it? For Vince Vendetta Morales! And again, a round of applause here for our guy, Joseph Cleveland, coming down from Coeur d'Alene, Idaho, to take part in Front Street Fights. Vince, come here for a second if we can have you. Your pro debut, you had a couple of fights here as an amateur. Nerves? Uh, a little bit, not so much towards, since I got in the cage, it got a little better. Looked like a pretty technical fight there. Both guys uh, trying to get the upper hand technically with some holds. Uh, what did it for you there? Yeah, um, I, I knew it was a jizz guy, so I was kind of, I've been preparing myself mentally for that. Uh, I always like to exchange a little more punches than what I got, but to win, I'll take it. What's next for you, Vince? Again, your pro debut here. Another front street fight on the card. What, what's next? I'm always down for another front street fight. Um, hopefully, I don't know, give me another fight in a month and a half. I'll love that. A lot of noise here tonight for your guy, Vince Morales. Tell us here who you want to thank and, and who helped you get into the ring here tonight. All my, all my sponsors really helped me out a lot with all, everything they've been doing for me lately. Uh, family, of course. All them. I love it. Uh, Family, my, my friends, everybody's just been supporting me. Everybody who came out, I love that. Thank you guys. Actually, all you. <laughs> um, dang, and I really, my coach just passed not too long ago. I really want to dedicate this win to him. Uh, there's not a lot of, I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for him, so thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, how about it? For Vendetta, Vince Morales.